This presentation was made by ChatGPT. I know it looks pretty impressive, right? Well, here's the reality behind it. You can actually try this yourself. All you have to do is go to ChatGPT and ask it to create a PowerPoint presentation or a VBA script for a PowerPoint presentation. Give it a topic, mention a few things like, you know, it should have these many slides, you should include content, don't include any generic stuff, etc. And it'll start putting together the content for you. Once you have the code, you can just copy it, launch PowerPoint, and then click on the developers tab there. If you don't see it, you just have to go to file options click on the customize ribbons thingy and on the right side you will see developers tab which usually is disabled by default just click on it and click ok you will see it enabled then select the visual basics option from the top left you will see this window either from the options up there or by right clicking select insert then module and then paste the VBA script that you copied and click run now sometimes it'll have errors you know chat GPT doesn't produce flawless things every time but thankfully you can just go back and ask it to fix that error. It's strange, isn't it? A program that can constantly learn, doesn't have to sleep or eat, can make mistakes. So can you. So be kind to yourself. At the same time, you're a lazy piece of shit who is using ChatGPT to make some simple thing like a presentation. You should be ashamed of Either way, once you have the code fixed, it may take a few iterations, but copy paste it and run, it'll just not do anything, hopefully, and just create the presentation in a certain path. You can specify the path yourself. In my case, it automatically created that file in the documents folder. And if we open it, here's the blank presentation. Let's make it nicer now. Yeah, those nice presentations that you see people showing on social media that ChatGPT made this, no, they are adding it themselves. You just have to search for some cool AI GIFs and then download them. And and then you basically set them as your background. That's it. It took a surprising amount of time for me to fix this presentation and make it look nicer. GPT had astonishingly not done a good job. So after doing all this manual work, the only thing GPT did for me was to fetch the content, which has to be rewritten anyways. So I would have been better off just asking GPT, just give me the content for the slides and I'll just copy paste the content myself. I'll prepare the slides myself. It's not doing anything amazing. Preparing slides is not that hard. So yeah, this is the reality behind the glamorous Instagram reels that you're seeing about GPT making presentations. It's nowhere near as flawless as they make it seem. Every time there's a new trend going on, I go behind the scenes and make sure you know the truth. I hope you appreciate that enough to leave a like. Other than that, yeah, go ahead and try it yourself. You know, your results may vary. Let me know what you think.